YouTube, what is going on? It's your boy GlitcherBro23. Hey man, y'all know what it is already, man. We haven't done one of these in a minute. And that's mainly just because of the fact that we took the break. We didn't record the Monday right before the break, I believe. So we're back with the MGK Mondays, man. Uh, shout out to the MGK. He just won a award for I don't know. He won some kind of award for a rock artist of the year or something like that at the AMAs or some shit like that. Um, so shout out to MGK for that. Congratulations on that. But we finna just spin the wheel. Y'all know what it is already. We have all the MGK suggestions we were given. We have them on a wheel, and we, we're finna find out which track we're actually finna react to. Y'all guys already know based on the title, or anything, and everything. But here we go. What do we got? What do we got this MGK Monday? We got. In the road. Street dreams. Street dreams. Alright, let's go ahead and check that out. Like always, man, if you guys are enjoying the MGK Mondays and want to see more Machine Gun Kelly reactions in the future, y'all know what to do by this point, man. Hit that like button if you enjoy, subscribe to the channel if you're new, comment down below what you guys want to see next, share your thoughts and opinions about the track of my reaction to it by the end of the video. If you guys want to join my Discord with Litcher Gang, there you can personally DM me requests for future reactions. All you gotta do, click that link down below in the description as well. But other than that, we finna check out the lyric video of Street Dreams. There's a reason I had lyrics on the um, on the wheel itself. You know what I mean? So maybe this is one of MGK's like tracks where he just goes off like his Midwest chopper flow. Who knows? But uh, we finna check this out, man. Short track, actually. Only three minutes long. Let's get into it, though. I don't even remember what the last track was that when we did an MGK Monday. I know I made the pause, like, in the session. I just had to make sure that I was still recording now. Okay, here we go. Count crack rock in that padlock. With a stash spot in my right top, street dreams down the block of my dash spot. Bad cops on my payroll, hey, and a buck pop like Fago. At 50 cent, but like three keys, open up the doors for that yo. White nights and I make snow, bright lights and I lay low. Fight nights, I'm like Mike Tyson, KO for that peso. That's the life that we chose. Talking about money, cars, and need clothes. Fucking with 20 brothers exposed, then we in a strip club for they clothes. These are the chronicles of a hood motherfucker doing what they gotta do to get paid. Products broken every follicle of my shades. Writing my bitch every dick of my Grave, cause all they say is jail and death And I figure there ain't nothing left that dying dead So since I'm knee deep in my shit, don't hold my breath <gasps> Oh shit, gets us back to that broke shit Roach clip in my ashtray Tupac on my poster Dreams of living like Sosa But I'm waking up on this sofa So I'm waking up on this sofa I ain't waiting around here no longer So basically he just, um First of all, the flow on this one I like the cadences that he's going with Um He's just kind of talking about growing up a little bit in poverty, you know. He's like, I, I got to get out of this uh, situation, you know. He's talking about the day, days of dreaming of being successful and one, and living in those days. He had that hunger to uh, achieve those goals, you know what I mean? So, not too much to break down. Just a very, like, straightforward message of the track so far. Tupac on the po Tupac posters, you know. Wake it up on the sofa, like a bunch of things that you would hear from almost any rapper who was just trying to make it back in the day. Fight nice like Mike Tyson actually did like that line. Mike Tyson, KO for that peso. That's the life that we chose. Talk about money, cars, and need clothes. Fuck with 20 bronze that exposed. Then we in a strip club that they close. These are the chronicles of a hood motherfucker doing what they gotta do to get paid. Products broken every fella call of my shades. Writing my bitch every dig of my grave. Cause all they say is jail right, and death. Michael. And I think that there ain't That's nothing. A good one. Writing my obituary, digging my grave. Cause all they say is jail or death. That's like, I didn't even. And then following that up with that ain't. That I ain't did, and since I'm knee deep and shit, don't hold my breath. I ain't even think about that. That's a pretty good. That's a pretty good bar right there. Not even gonna lie. That one. That one went over the head at first. My grave, cause all they say is jail and death, and I think that there ain't nothing left that dying did. So since I'm knee deep in my shit, don't hold my breath. <gasps> Oh 
whole shit. Get back to that broke shit. Roach clip in my ashtray. Tupac on my posters. Dreams of living like Sosa. But I'm waking up on this sofa. Said I'm waking up on this sofa. I ain't waiting around here no longer. Get it how you live it, bitch. We living dirty. And bitch. most of us that's living now ain't living dirty. Get it how you live it, bitch. We living dirty. Cock that 38. Put on my mask and this gets blurry. I don't think you heard me. What I need a shirt for. When you be shit and you go hard, but that tour's gone and you back on to that street shit. What, what, what I need to shirt for? When these tattoos that I bleed with say everything about my story, come read this now. What I need to shirt for? Huh? What I need to shirt for? Huh? What I need to shirt for? What I need to shirt for? When I go hard, so hard to get everything that I work for. At the top is no friends, dog. At the bottom ain't shit, dog. Middle man and ain't it, dog. Plotting, drinking this hen dogs. And I said, Lord, my saviors, have I not protected my neighbor? Have I not neglected these haters? Have I not kept you with my prayers? So when my life keeps going downhill, I'm a romper looking upstairs. Am I wrong? Ooh, so when my life goes downhill, am I wrong for looking upstairs? That one's pretty, I like that line. Um, Kind of honestly, one of the most basic tracks I've heard from MGK, like so far, you know, like I said, it's kind of just a straightforward message. It's nothing that we haven't heard from him discussing before, especially if this is another track off his, like, one of his early mixtapes or one of his um, earlier, deb like, earlier albums, you know, nothing new that we haven't heard before. Um, he has that passion. I hear the passion in his voice and, like, the pain almost in the way he's writing, but um, kind of one of the more basic tracks from MGK, not even going to lie to you, you know? And like I said, it is kind of just straightforward. So this is one just basically for listening. There isn't, it isn't like bar heavy, crazy flows. Um, you know what I mean? So it's not a bad track though. Don't get me wrong. It's definitely not a bad track. Have I not neglected these haters? Have I not kept you with my prayers? So when my life keeps going downhill, am I wrong for looking upstairs? Am I wrong for feeling you hate me? Am I wrong for thinking you care? Am I wrong for keeping this weed lit and these smoke clouds in its air? But I can't sleep without my mind gone Cause the shit I witnessed last year, that boy that left out was just family I ain't okay. seeing shit coming. We were supposed to be at these Grammys. We were supposed to be starting shit. We were supposed to be something. Fuck that. We were supposed to be brothers. Helped you out when you were struggling. I don't know you nothing. Fuck what I need a shirt for. He was getting into something personal right there. Hold up, hold up. That boy that left out was just family. I ain't see the coming. We were supposed to be at the Grammys. We were supposed to be sun stunning. We were supposed to be something. Oh, so maybe... Okay, so it seems like in this situation... He was supposed to attend the Grammys. And that's... He, uh, he had a snake, I guess, in his group. Trying to take credit for... What he did. And MGK's like... Bro. I don't owe you nothing. You know what I mean? So... That's the what I would the way I would interpret it as I know the MGK fans would understand that better than me and probably actually know the situation he's talking about. But um that's just what I would interpret it as. It seems like Grammy Night came around, some an incident happened and now whoever this dude MGK is talking about was trying to snake him, you know what I mean? You were struggling, now I don't know you nothing. No. Very interesting. What I need to end up. When you be shit and you go hard, that tour's gone and you back on that street shit. What, what, what I need to shirt for? When these tattoos that I bleed with say everything about my story, come read this now. What I need to shirt for? Huh? What I need to shirt for? Huh? What I need to shirt for? What I need to shirt for? When I go hard, so hard to get everything that I work for. Kells. Yeah, um. Was not to okay, yeah, so it was off his own. It was off of one of his early mixtapes. Wasn't too crazy about that one. Like I said, I, I didn't hate it, but definitely not one of my favorite tracks I've reacted to from MGK. Um, just kind of seemed very plain and just straightforward, in my opinion. You know, it was very interesting the thing talking about at the end with the whole Grammy situation. Um, obviously, not an issue with the Grammys, but an issue that happened at the Grammys for him. 
Um, beat was kind of it sounded it sounded like MGK was trying to be like motivational in a way. It just I don't think it really necessarily hit like on uh, like. Like this song with the return, like I remember that song was actually really solid. I'm not gonna lie. Um, but let me know what you guys thought about that in the comment section down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are excited to see MGK Monday's return, we're gonna be continuing this, man. I know I've been kind of hoeing you MGK fans uh, with the MGK Mondays, and I do apologize for that. I'm gonna, we're gonna keep going. We're gonna get all those requests off the wheel eventually. Know what I mean? But if you all want to see more, y'all know what to do by this point. Hit that like button if you enjoy. Subscribe to the channel for new. Comment down below what you guys want to see next. Share your thoughts, opinions about the track, my reaction to it. If you want to join the Discord? Link will be down below in the description along with the rest of my social medias. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next time.